All right, and if we push the Tom Nook ice sculpture to 8 feet, what does that do to the price? Right. Uh, yeah, better make it 8 feet. I don't want it overshadowed by the Mr. Rossetti vodka luge. Now, catering is nailed down. I want to circle around to this Isabel Fireworks Spectacular at midnight. Because... Yeah, I already talked to Daniela. I, I already talked to... If you'll listen, I already talked to Daniela and she assured me, I'm looking at it now, a firework could be made to explode in the shape of a dog's face. Well, I put it in the invite. It, so it's happening, so don't bring me problems, bring me solutions. Oh, sorry about that, Ellen. Just Animal Crossing New Horizons launch party planning. A little bit stressful. Uh, how are you, Ellen? Oh, I'm okay, just a bit, yeah. Sorry, I gotta take that as my wardrobe planning department. Yeah, hi, Martin, yeah, hi, Martin, Martin, I can't budge on this. No fur. No, no, the outside of my KK Slider costume has to be smooth vinyl. Because I'm going to be emerging from a cake, Martin. Show of the weekend, show of the weekend. Show of the weekend, show of the weekend. Show of the weekend. What is just... Just part, what? it's part, it's part, it's just organization. Just, it's fine. It's gonna be a hell of a party. Where's my invite? Oh, there, there are no guests. It's just, oh. just me. It's, just <laughs> it's gonna be a real rager though. It's yeah. gonna go on for like 72 hours. <laughs> just me, yeah. Screaming into the ear <laughs> of a Tom Nakai sculpture. <laughs> I haven't talked to the gang in years. I don't see them anymore. <laughs> well, they don't email me either. Right. <laughs> Is it coming like? <laughs> right, seriousness though, yeah. because Ellen, we are going to play a game now <sighs> that is known to some, everyone, as Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Team DX Adventures Rescue Team <laughs> Mystery Dungeon. Wait, what's the game of the game? <laughs> all of those words are in the title, in the title so in just rearrange them. Of, it's all the right words, just not necessarily in the right order. Look. It's a Pelipper, I think. That's what that Pokemon is. <laughs> I don't, I don't. <laughs> look at that. Oh, look at the Pidgey. It's the world of Pokemon. Yeah. And it's become real. <gasps> Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Can Rescue Team DX. That's what I said. Pokemon is real, though. Pokemon is real. Pokemon is real and anime is real. <laughs> <laughs> this is an old, old game. Yeah. Um, that came out on handheld consoles and it's mm -hmm. been remastered. <laughs> I use the word remaster lightly because, as okay. you'll see visually, it's a little basic, but mm -hmm. it's supposed to be a great game. So that we're going to play just the beginning. This is the portal that leads to the world of Pokemon. But before I can let you through, I have several questions. All right, you. Obi Wan. <laughs> I want you to answer them sincerely. We've got Alec Guinness in the room. <laughs> are, you, are you ready? <laughs> can you sincerely thank someone when you feel grateful? Yeah. I think so. Yeah. We're going to answer these questionnaire collectively. So yeah, I, yeah. Think, I think so. I feel like I can. Your friend fails to show up for a meeting at the promised time. Ooh. Unfriend. What, <laughs> what do, do you do? do? Hmm. Hmm. I don't get angry and bail. That's I too know, far. I know. That's too far. But Might be, maybe well, I'm I irritated. I don't. If if we miss an appointment because of it, then I'd be mad. But otherwise, I don't mind. If you're meeting at an appointed time, yeah. Probably, probably okay. like there was a, probably okay. that time was chosen for a reason. Mm -hmm. You know. I think become irritated. Yeah. yeah. Flying to a blind rage. <laughs> Do you often yawn? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, your friend is being bullied. Oh no. What do you do? Heckle the bully from behind. <laughs> <laughs> face up. What? What? Face, face up. up to the bully. Yeah. I think. Leave my friend alone. Yeah. Reluctantly, but yeah. yeah. Like, like, oh, hey, God. you. Uh, mm. <laughs> maybe stop it. <laughs> it's a weekend, but no one will play with you. What do you do? Go on trip. Hang around vacantly. Huddle in the corner. Huddle in a corner. <laughs> huddle in a corner. Should we choose that one? Yeah. Do you like to noisily enjoy yourself with others? <laughs> Let me just check the age rating on this. <laughs> Karaoke, yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Do others often call you childish? <laughs> yeah. It's been known to happen. Uh... Grab any digit on your left hand with your right hand. Which digit did you grab? Middle. Ring. Uh, oh, well, ring. We went, well, they, Let's they both average have it to rings. middle. Let's average it to middle. <laughs> middle finger. <laughs> Do you want to play as a boy or a girl? 
Go. Go. What have we got? What I think that's got? the end what of the questionnaire. What have we got? We got. What, gonna... Pokemon what Pokemon is it going are to make we? us? <laughs> you appear to be the jolly type. Always laughing and smiling, you uplift everyone around you. Aww. Shucks, Pokemon. You love jokes, You love yeah. jokes! You have lots of friends, and you're popular wherever you go. Aww. All right. Game, you're starting to make me nervous. <laughs> but sometimes you get carried away and say things that get you in trouble. <laughs> you should learn to think before saying or doing anything! Ooh. Anything! <laughs> Sorry. Never, ever, ever act impulsively. This game's giving us such a hard time. I know! Sorry, A jolly Pokemon. person like you should be... Should be... What are we? What are we? What are we? Totodile! <laughs> Fair enough! <laughs> I like Totodile! <laughs> Ellen's face! You appear to be the Pokemon Totodile, is that correct? <laughs> you want to say no, don't you? No, that isn't right. <laughs> Which Pokemon would you like to be? <laughs> no, I thought they would like come up with another one that you're sort of like. No, no, they're like, look, we... we Fine, look, we'll be Totodile! In your heart of hearts, Ellen, it's analysed you and your Totodile, so we have to be Totodile. Look. We don't, we're not, we don't always turn out to be the people we want to be. And sometimes that's Totodile. <laughs> this is the final step. Who would you like to have as a partner? Um, okay, so this one we can choose. Oh, right. Who will your partner be, Ellen? And why Ooh. is it Meowth? <laughs> I mean, if you want to go with Meowth, let's go with Meowth. Who think gives you like a random selection? I want to go with Meowth, I don't know why. Yeah, let's do it. It's, but this is both of us. This is an amalgamation yeah, that's true. That's of the true. both of us. Meowth? <laughs> it's our surprise. <laughs> yeah, it's yeah. Meowth. Should your partner be a boy or a girl? Uh, meowth, toast dog, girl gang? Yeah. So a girl Meowth, right? Yeah. What is your partner's nickname? Meowth. meowth. <laughs> is Meowth alright for a nickname? Yeah. Yep. Oh, Meowth. Oh, okay. That was, a, that was an animation. Are these two all right? <laughs> <laughs> we don't know, game. Okay, okay we're find we're out. all set. Let's get you into the world of Pokemon. Go for it. <laughs> Looks like they've died. Where am I? <laughs> don't follow the light, me <laughs> Am I dreaming this? I feel a pleasant breeze. <laughs> I am a Totodile. I hear a voice from somewhere. Nah. I wonder who it is. Meowth, that's right! <laughs> <laughs> hey, it's me, Meowth, from the anime! <laughs> Why do they have, like, this Brooklyn accent? Sort it's, of? <laughs> it's all explained Meowth, in the episode. Meowth, that's right! Meowth teaches itself to talk. I can't remember why, but it does. Please wake, wake up. up, come on, oh, wake, wake up. up. What's this? Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Meowth, great! <laughs> <laughs> Oh. oh, we're in first person now. Oh, where, where is, is this? You were passed out here. I'm glad to see you awake. I'm Meowth. Happy to meet you. And you are... I've never seen you around before. Yes. <laughs> uh, you say you're a human? But you look like <laughs> a normal Totodile in every way. Huh? <laughs> 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 It, it's true. I have turned into a Totodile. But why? <laughs> why? 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 Uh, um, you're kind of weird. <laughs> your name? What's your name? My name? That's right, my name is... Totodile. <laughs> yeah. yeah. What should we go for? We'll go for uh, Oxtra. Yeah. yeah. Good. Is Oxtra okay? Yes. <laughs> Isn't it a funny name? Hey! <laughs> Shouts from over there. <gasps> it's a Butterfree! Oh. What's wrong? I'm so worried! It's horrible, my caterpie oh, no. fell into a cavern! My poor baby! What? A huge fissure opened in the ground and my caterpie fell in. Oh no! He's too young to crawl out by himself. <laughs> when I went to get my baby, Pokemon suddenly attacked me. I hate Pokemon. <laughs> Huh? You were attacked by, by other, other Pokemon. Pokemon. They must be enraged by the Fisher and out of control. That's what I think. Oh. I'm not strong enough to fend off those wild Pokemon. No. What will become of my baby? <laughs> what am I to do? Oh dear. This sounds bad. We have to go help. Uh, and, and off they go. 
with that 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 animation. I'm not. I'm never gonna be over that. Could this be a mystery dungeon? It is. It's, it's a, a mystery, mystery dungeon. dungeon. Mystery dungeon is truly a mysterious place. Whoa. Well, that's why it's a mystery. <laughs> change every time you enter. Clues in the name. <laughs> is it also a dungeon meal? <laughs> You can proceed by using the stairs, but you have to find, find the, the stairs, stairs first. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he, it looks like he's pedaling a bike. Oh, wait. A Pokemon. Kill it. Oh, no. Kill it. Yes. Yeah. Oh, no. Enemies. Kill it, Totodile. Yeah. Oh, it died. All right. Oxtra returned to normal speed. What's that? <laughs> Pidgey. Oh no, it woke up. Woo. Oh no, my attack missed. Yeah. Oh, it's dead. <laughs> this music is something as well. <laughs> Press L for auto mode. Oh. Hey, the game plays itself. <laughs> oh, yeah. cool. Got a coin? Yeah. Oh, this is brilliant. Why don't all games do this? <laughs> <laughs> oh, auto mode ends. Oh, fine. Man. No, oh, took him out. In Dead. One. Well, we're going back up here. Okay. All right. Well, all right. it's auto mode, so. It's auto mode, it's baby. Auto mode, baby. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. Yeah, let's go on. This is great. I've only pressed one button. Oh. Uh oh. Mommy, where are you? We came to rescue you. Your mum's waiting. Let's get you out. Okay. No. Oh, we did it. Yay! Yay! We did the rescue. We did the thing. My baby's safe. I'm sorry, I don't know how I could ever thank you properly. Oh, like, <laughs> 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 Me, yeah, it's like... Hi. It's been dangerous lately with sudden quakes and fissures <laughs> like that one. Ooh. It was great to find your little boy unharmed. Aww. Please, may I have your names at least? I'm Hi, Meowth. Meowth. And this, this is, is Oxtra. <laughs> yeah. Cool. cool. He's uh, staring at me adoringly. <laughs> Those sparkly eyes. It's a little embarrassing. But this doesn't feel bad either. <laughs> it's like I'm a hero. <laughs> me? Helping Pokemon in trouble might be a good experience. <gasps> Thank you, Meowth and Oxtra. I know it isn't really enough, but this is taken of our thanks. Please accept it. Yay, a tiny revive seed. And a, and a berry. And 500 pounds. <laughs> Thanks, Butterfree. Thank you, Butterfree. <laughs> yeah. Meowth's got to wet his beak. What are you going to do? Do you have any plans? Well, probably find out why I'm a Pokemon. <laughs> okay, no, apparently that's not Listen, on the menu. Listen, Oxtra, if you don't have a place to stay, you should come with me. Don't go with that Meowth. <laughs> he did exactly what he did. Oh my god, it's a palace! <laughs> I can't explain, but I'm happy. Aww. I can explain, you've just been given a house for free. <laughs> I'm a human being, but I like this place. I feel weirdly happy. Mm. It might be an instinct thing for Pokemon. What, to have like a mailbox and a house? <laughs> yeah. Maybe this is what it feels like to, to want, want to, to wag, wag your, your tail. tail. <laughs> Doesn't matter, I'm happy. Yeah, don't overthink your toaster. Maybe I feel that way because I'm a Totodile. Oh, Oxtra, you're impressed, aren't you? Yeah. I thought so, I thought this would make a good place for you to live, Oxtra. I was sure you would like it. Aww. This is your mailbox. They deliver mail from other Pokemon here. Oh my god, they have their own mailing system. <laughs> yeah, I'm starting to think it's cruel to be catching Pokemon. <laughs> they have so their own They clearly like... have their own society. <laughs> there, have been, there have been all sorts of natural disasters recently. I want to do good. I want to help Pokemon like that. I want to help make the world a safer place for Pokemon. So, um... <laughs> Wait, where is this <laughs> I saw how good you were when we rescued Caterpie. Would you like to form a <laughs> rescue team? Yeah, yeah. Would you like to form a rescue team with me? <laughs> it's quite a sweet proposal. Yeah. Oh, I love you. I think we could be the world's number one rescue team, Oxtra. Uh, what do you think? Yeah. Review. No. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> oh, no. Lol, JK. Lol, JK. Oxtra, I'm sure that we would make a <laughs> Together. Oh, no, 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 Mia. Stop hurting me out. All right. Exactly. Mia is wounded. All right. We'll form a rescue team. 
My house will always know that there's something going to be done. <laughs> For now on Oxtra, we're partners in our rescue team. I'm so glad. <sighs> the team's name is... I haven't decided on one. What would be a good name for us? Wisdom? Uh -uh. <laughs> what do you think? I think... Well, we should think of like one... Kill them all. No! <laughs> is there something like Team Synergy? Or like one of those oh, Apprentice Oh, like something that's going to be on ones. The Apprentice, yeah. <laughs> How about Synergy Wise? Because it's like Wise Synergy. Take that as a yes. <laughs> this is going to look great written down. <laughs> Synergy wise. <laughs> what do you think, Meow? Do you still want to be in a rescue team? <laughs> okay, I know I asked like three times. But <laughs> Synergy wise. I like, like it. It's a good name. It's oh, perfect. Right, Meow. Meow can be out in victory. Who are you trying to convince? Yeah. Oh, and one more thing. I wanted to wear this on the day I got started on a rescue team. I have two of them, so let's put them on. Ooh, nice oh, oh neckerchiefs. Oh, you wear it well, Oxtra. Don't you feel focused, like we're on the same team together? Ooh. Rescue team synergize. Yeah. Let's do good starting tomorrow. tomorrow. <laughs> that sounds like the beginning of a great night. <laughs> let's do good starting tomorrow. tomorrow. <laughs> Let's put the sin in synergize. <laughs> and that is how <laughs> Oxtra and Meowth began their careers together. Oh, careers as a rescue team. Careers. <laughs> careers. So there was some Pokemon rescue team Yay. squads. We so did it. Apparently if you merge the two of us, you get a Totodile. <laughs> yeah, I've long said it. I Totodile. Totodile was my starter in Gold and Silver, I think it was. But, Ellen, Pokemon Mystery Dungeon DX uh, dun Rescue Squad T DX is not, if you can believe it, the most exciting thing coming out on Switch this month. Right. Because we are looking forward to Animal Crossing New Horizons. It's going to be massive. I'm going to quiz you on it. Here we go. Animal Crossing New Horizons is only a few weeks away, the longed for next entry in the super chill community sim, which sees you moving to a remote island because notorious con man Tom Nook persuaded you it was a good idea. New Horizons sees you moving to a beautiful island, expect to experience all manner of weather, catch bugs, go fishing, acquire furniture, and live your best island life. Hashtag best island life. Eventually, you'll fill your island with museums and even reshape the landscape. But to begin with, you're washing up with only a few possessions to call your own, and not much to entertain you except foraging for supplies and crafting. Yeah. Ellen, if you were headed to a desert island, Ooh. what would you bring with you to keep you occupied? You can choose one album, one movie, one TV box set, and one piece of sporting hardware. Ooh. I just don't want you to miss out if you're into like rollerblading or something. So we've got to go quick you fire here. On the <laughs> you, you would build a rink, right, out of bamboo. It's not right. hard. Okay. To do that. Nice roller rink. It's an easy okay. thing to do. Uh, all right. Not so quick good. fire because because <laughs> Tom Tom Nook has knocked on your door in the middle of the night and he's bundling you into his van uh, to set you to the plane. One album. One album. Uh, I'm not good at this. <laughs> Well, Someone asked me like what my favourite thing is, and I'm like, well, I like this, 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 this. Well, there you go, you can only take one. Uh, can I take like a Spotify playlist? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> I want my daily mix. Oh. There's no Wi-Fi on the island. There's, um, only, there's only an old CD player um, covered in rust and crabs and barnacles. Her, well, right now, what I'm listening to a lot is the Birds of Prey soundtrack. Oh, cool. Which is yeah, outstanding. Good one. Yeah, pretty trendy. Um, Pretty hip. Mm -hmm, but. What's it called? Let Go, the Avril Lavigne album. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Let Go, sorry. Hmm. Linkin Park. Yeah. There's a correct answer here. Well, there isn't. Oh, do I go with Hybrid Theory or Meteora? Not Hybrid Theory. <laughs> Like breaking the habit on it and yeah and faint, and faint which is one of my favorite songs it's good i know it's good okay, yeah. 
Hybrid Theory. Man. I listened to that on repeat on a school trip in the Pyrenees in Spain. Nice. That was good. On my CD Walkman. <laughs> my special uh, Hybrid Theory memory is um, using Napster to download Dragon Ball Z AMVs that were like <laughs> clips of Dragon Ball set to paper cut. Yeah, future trunks. <laughs> All right, film. film. Has Avril Lavigne ever done a documentary? <laughs> uh, why do you have to go make things so complicated? Um, thanks, John. Well, it's only 20 minutes, but <laughs> the MTV Essential 2007 documentary. Ah, cool, uh, Avril Lavigne live performance, My World. Right. Um, the HSBC Arena in Buffalo, New York. The Nightmare Before Christmas, because then I'm cheating, because then I get the soundtrack to that. Cool. All right. As well, and I love Danny Elfman. Um, TV box set. TV box set. Buffy. Cool. And then what's the other one? <laughs> one piece sporting of sporting equipment. hardware. Uh, Just wondering if maybe we should be trying to consume more media from the modern age. <laughs> <laughs> um, Bear in mind, you might have to defend yourself in the night from bears and stuff. Oh, I was going to say like football, but uh... You could kick a football in its face. <laughs> it's easy just to kick them in the face. I mean, I'm not that. I'm, I'm, I yeah, can but kick you can do it from ball, range. But... You have to get close. <laughs> Try and kick a bear, it might just catch your foot in its mouth. <laughs> it's the end of well, if it's career. also defensive, then probably like... I've never, oh, maybe a baseball bat, but I've not really played baseball, but I have played rounds. Yeah, but like, you get the premise of swinging the bat. <laughs> but then, what? Into a bear. <laughs> if I, if I, if I hit the one ball I had and it was like, bait. <laughs> yeah. I think baseball's float. You could always swim out. Yeah, I okay. could, yeah. yeah. But then I'd need someone to throw it at me. <laughs> oh yeah, That's the bear. <laughs> Train the bear. A yo-yo. <laughs> Oh, yo, yo, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh man, imagine, imagine, yeah, when Rescue shows up 20 years later, they're like, wow, you're really good at the yo, yo. They're like, I used my time wisely to master the yo, yo. Wow. Hit the yo, yo master. Yeah, yeah. Johans thought his, thought his supremacy was assured until Ellen okay, comes back from the island. one of those light up ones that you uh, used to get when... Uh, if it contains a clutch, it's not allowed in competitions. <laughs> Why do I know? Why do I know? <laughs> because you're cool, Luke. Because I'm cool. Yeah, see the cool. Right, let's move on quickly. Ellen, you'll arrive on your new home as part of the Nook Inc. getaway package, which sees you saddled with substantial debt in exchange for what seems to be a tent and a radio on a deserted island. It's a classic Tom Nook move. But Ellen, what's a time when you got ripped off? <laughs> oh. oh, once I went into a, a, a phone shop and they sold me a contract that, well, it was fine, but they were all like, uh, oh, if you take this phone and then you can sell it on eBay and it's worth this much, so you definitely get that much for it. You wouldn't get that much for it. Mm. So I actually went back in the next day to just be like, that was the worst sales experience I've ever had in my life. And I felt very pressured into it. So I was like 18 and I was like, yeah. I'm never doing this again. Well done so for going back. My, um, what did they have to say for themselves they, the they, time? they panicked a little bit because I went back in and Put I was like- Put the shutters down. Yeah, <laughs> I was like, can I, I, I don't like this. And they like, they sat me down and they were like, oh, I'm so sorry. and uh, And like, gave me some stuff, I don't know, but they, they like tried to assure me it was fine and I was like, well, I just want to say that was not a pleasant experience because I came out of the shop kind of going, uh, okay, okay. I, I have, uh, uh. Uh. so that's why whenever you go into a phone shop, know exactly what you want because they'll always try and upsell you. Sim only um, deals Simo are better. Yeah. Folks, if you can handle the upfront expense, it's always yeah. cheaper save to buy Save up, the save up, buy the handset Unlocked. and then get a Sim second. the resale. Yeah. Ellen. Yes. <laughs> Yes. 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 <laughs> At the heart of any Animal Crossing game are the relationships you'll forge with the quirky island residents, getting tangled up in their lives, helping them out, discovering their personalities and enjoying the unfolding drama. You'll doubtless meet famous Animal Crossing stars such as Tom Nook, Mr. Rossetti, Isabel, and a certain musical hound. K.K. Slider. K.K. Slider. Indeed, K.K. Slider's music and the whimsical soundtrack throughout underpin Animal Crossing's charm, which is why, Ellen, there's no better way of testing your readiness for New Horizons than by seeing how good a K.K. Slider you make. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> That's right. Now, I've been experimenting and I'm like 70% sure this will work. <laughs> so, I have a microphone here. Okay. 
and I am going to get you to record a few KK Slider noises, but also using a MIDI file of an animal bit of Animal Crossing music uh -huh. that I found on the internet. Okay. Thanks to whoever made that MIDI file, <laughs> these things are lost to us. I've been installing sound fonts. It's been a wild ride, Ellen. But I think it, I think it, I'm 90% sure it will work. First I will record you making some KK slider noises. Okay. And then I will need 10 minutes in private. <laughs> and we will create some, some beautiful music. And I okay. can't, I can't wait for you to hear it. Okay, so Ellen, are you ready to make some noises first? Yeah, what do you, what noise? And just like, wah, noises. Oh, Ellen, it's a little more sophisticated <laughs> than that. First, and this is important, all the sounds that I need you to make must all be the same key. pitch. Pitch, that's right, because they're all going into a sampler and then they're same going to be modulated. Okay. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. So we're going to find you a nice C Wee. note. Mm. I think that's it. I'll be super impressed if it is. Give it a, do it again. We're mm. testing Ellen's perfect pitch now, a bit louder. Mm. And here is a C. Mm. Oh. No. <laughs> <laughs> here is a C. Mm -hmm. Go down an octave. And first, I want you to give me, first I want you to give me a me. Okay. Me. Good, and one a little shorter. Me. Very nice. Now I want you to give me a na. Na. And now a way. Way. And now another me. Me. And now a, one of his little grunts. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> and now, oh. Oh. But in that, in that key. Oh. Very good. Way. Way. Very nice. And now a howl. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yep, perfect. <laughs> All right. Now talk amongst yourselves for 10 minutes. Okay. <laughs> Okay, Ellen, so I have fed your marvellous performances into some sampling software. Great. Modelled it on the KK slider. Well, I didn't really do it. You know what? We don't need to get into why. Let's just... <laughs> do you want to hear yeah. your KK slider yeah. performance? Let's see how well you did. Well done, Ellen. <laughs> well done to you. And well, that was, of course, a be that was, a as you'll know, because your case, like case lighter now, basically, mm -hmm. a beautiful performance of Forest Life Aww. from Animal Crossing. Hashtag New Leaf, maybe? Forest Life. <laughs> Hashtag all about that Forest Life. Would you like to? Would you like to complete the picture by by strumming along and miming? Now that you've got the tune. Yeah. There we go, Ellen. Oh, thank you. <laughs> My favourite was your. It's <laughs> just a noise I make a lot anyway. Did I hear that?
<laughs> okay, well, the rest of my day is going to be playing. <laughs> oh, no. Ella, do you want to tidy your room? <laughs> oh and here's what I have goodness. to say to that. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, Ellen, I think we proved that you are ready for Animal Crossing. Yeah. New Horizons. But shall we find out what you guys have been getting ready for? <gasps> in, in the, the comments. comments. Last week we looked at some of the items in video games you only had one chance to get, including a very special magical mask in Skyrim. There is one mask though that you're liable to miss if you're not careful, the Narkrin mask. That's because its owner lives in an area of Skyrim called Skuldafen, which you visit only once during the game's main quest. And once you leave, you can never return. A bit like the Olive Garden. Although thinking about it, that's worse because once you're banned from one of those, you're banned from all of them. I've heard. Some people noticed something about our footage, Luke, including commenter Jason Sorin, who said, Mike named his Skyrim character Zelda. I'm not sure whether to laugh, groan, or smite. Actually, fun fact, that was recorded on Luke's uh, No, it's uh, Mike, Mike, what's he like? Character called Zelda. <laughs> Rich backstory about her traveling through a portal from Hyrule. What's he like anywhere else we're on the channel? Ellen set sail for the Caribbean as she streamed Assassin's Creed Black Flag, taking Edward Kenway on great adventures and befriending all the animals. Dog, 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 yeah, who's a good doggo? Yeah, you are. Arr, 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 arr. I'm going to pet you again because you're such a good dog. <laughs> This is the next hour of the stream. Some people enjoyed your approach to the game, Ellen, including Holly, who had some ideas for future streams. Ellen petting a dog repeatedly. This is it. This is the next hour of the stream. She jokes as if we wouldn't all absolutely watch the Ellen Pats Animals in game series for hours on end. Well, I am happy to oblige. I will pet all the doggos, all the cute little kitties, all the little piggles. Say hi but Ellen, surely hello. you do want to finish the game at some point. What, what about the Assassin's Brotherhood? Let me find. Elsewhere on the channel, Luke was back in Breath of the Wild playing Master Mode, baby, and got up to a bunch of stuff, including finally taming the Lord of the Mountain. Thank you, Lord of the Mountain, for letting me letting me ride on you. Um, can we take some selfies together? No, 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 where you going? Oh. <laughs> Oh, it was not to be. Everyone was really pleased for you, Luke, including Emma Jane, who said, Oh, the Lord of the Mountain is camera shy. Congratulations, Luke. After your last encounter during the Blood Moon, I'm glad you finally got your noble steed and on stream too. Yes, well, it was a lot of hard work, months of training and dedication led me to that moment. But, but it wasn't just me. I'd like to thank my friends and family and, of course, all of you who were supporting me on that stream. Uh, in fact, I've, uh, I've prepared a, a few more words. Oh, oh no, that's fine, Luke. But uh, elsewhere on the channel, Wheels joined us from Dicebreaker for a special show of the weekend where we played Crazy Tower and things got a little heated. <laughs> That's how he gets you. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Yes, 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 yes. Holy so moly. Some viewers noticed a certain side to you, Ellen, with Siddhartha Daker saying, Ellen, I'm going to shove this up your nose. Whoa, Ellen, your competitive streak is showing. Oh, I'm the competitive one, not Mr. Tries to distract me as I put a block down. Okay, Ellen, it is just a game, okay? So <laughs> That's rich coming from you. No, actually, no. I am being silly. It is just a game. Then I won twice. Okay, right, we didn't decide beforehand who should go first, and I think uh, colour choice makes a big difference. No, it if doesn't! I'd been a, yes. No! Look, you yes. chose purple, yeah. and the psychological benefits of a colour that calming cannot be underestimated. Oh, I'm sorry, oh, look, not a clear the, advantage the fiery advantage of a red. You have very small hands. Yes, I do! No. You should have to play with big gloves on. <laughs> Friends, good, good. <laughs> yeah, of yeah. course, of it's course. Only a game. And also, we can all agree that the real villain of the piece was Wheels. Wheels, <laughs> who was the one we were too busy fighting each other. We did not see the enemy. See the true team. enemy. Wheels. <laughs> I love saying Wheels in a wheels. angry voice. Wheels. 
Wheels. Well. <laughs> well. Wheels. Wheels. Yeah. What have you wheels, got? What wheels, wheels, wheels. Wheel, wheelity, wheelity. <laughs> wheelity. <laughs> right, what have you got for me, Alan? Got some art. Art. Uh, uh, you really put that art in art. <laughs> an Animal Crossing fan, as we've established. Meep, 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 meep. Yeah. Well, a Mushu yes. has sent us in our D and D characters, but oh. does Animal Crossing? Yeah. Oh, I would move to this village. Yeah, oh, look how cute. Prudence Corazon's is like a little. Lion. Yeah, Prudence is a little goat. A little goat, Prudence. Mm. Oh, they all look so cute. They're all adorable. Like, <laughs> I just love how like Dob is still like huge. Can't believe you leave. Yeah. Animal Crossing characters are sort of the same height, but Dob's still like. Yeah. <laughs> and like Egbert's just got such a like. He's like yeah. cute little big eyes, and Johnny just looks so done with all of us. Oh, <laughs> poor little villager Johnny. I love him. <laughs> Oh, I would take all the apples so from his much. garden. Oh, that's not the only <laughs> D&D art that we have. <gasps> Dave McKay, who we've been featuring, he's been doing some Mass Effect Oh yeah, this Ma the Mass Effect D&D yes. crossover. Now he's on Merylway. Hey, look, and that makes everyone, right? Yeah, that's everyone. And he's even put us all together oh, woof, in a nice set. Like, look at that. Look at that. that that'd be good box art. The gang's all here. Yeah. The gang's all here. Hashtag squad goals. Get in touch. EA. Yeah. Does EA yeah. do? Does EA? Well, they're depends how they're feeling. <laughs> <laughs> they're not gonna. <laughs> they're so busy with Anthem. Uh <laughs> Whoa! Sorry. Whoa! I'm sorry. You know it's a good burn when you feel compelled to immediately <laughs> apologise afterwards. Well, maybe I will make maybe we my move on. escape on this Joyful Damnation! Whoa, someone's building a Joyful yeah. Damnation! This was sent to us by Duncan Collins Whoa. on Twitter, and it's a work in progress. I am very, very, very intrigued as to what the final product's gonna look like. And what is it? Is it a ship that you've already got and you're just like decorating, decorating it? Decorating that. Look, or have you built it? It's like, built from I, I love, I would love to know, because yeah. either way, it looks Fabulous, and I cannot see. Like, cannot wait to see. It looks seaworthy. It does look seaworthy. Also, look at look at the look at the back of it. Yes. It's very HMS Victory. Yes. Ooh, so, <laughs> so tall. So oh tall. yeah. Yes. Oh yes. Good boat. You can imagine. Good boat. Good lean, sails. Leaning out the rear window with a uh, like yes, they're gonna <laughs> chase. But I think we can lose them in the fog. <laughs> Stern chasers! Yeah! Yes! Life on the sea. Yes. It's beautiful. Thank you all for your amazing artwork. It is tremendous. That would have been better if one of the arts was of a tree. Yeah. But just pretend that it was. So well, and that brings us to the end mm -hmm. of show of the weekend. Yeah. What have uh, by the time this goes out, what will we have been up to this week that people can watch on the channel? Oh, uh, we'll have been doing some more live streams. You're gonna, so you can you go will and have watch played. Some mods. Yeah. yeah get in the ship. No, and get in the ship. <laughs> that's it. That's it. Because the, the spokes. And you oh go right. <laughs> And then that's the stuff. Dogs. Yeah. And the cats go. Um, and, and a bit more master mode, a bit yeah, more Breath of the Wild. Nice. Surf on the shield. That's my favourite bit of yep. Breath of the Wild. Mm -hmm. Take all the shield off. surf off a cliff and then. Yeah, close off. <laughs> I saw your conversation with S2. To close off. <laughs> that was a private conversation. It's <laughs> <laughs> a private conversation. <laughs> Between, between, between two nudity enthusiasts. <laughs> between a tree person and a small hero. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. What are you going to in the privacy of the coral forest? <laughs> Is yeah. your business. What, stay, what happens in the coral forest stays, stays in the coral forest. Stays in the coral forest. <laughs> exactly. That's what exactly. all the for. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, uh, so, Ellen, yeah. we've had a wonderful time. Yeah. We've got, we played Pokemon. Yeah. We found out that you're a Dota Dial. We're, we're a Dota Dial. Sorry, we're a Dota Dial. Oh, sorry. Yeah. It's a Disney thing. Different. Uh, and, and do you learn that you have a, a magical musical streak? Well, I don't play the ukulele. 
Wow. Do you not? <laughs> <laughs> well, that one's strong left-handed, so that's why you're struggling. Oh. That's, yeah, there we go. Oh, there we go, yeah. It's the last of us. Got bad. If you put that in a trailer with a bunch of reverb on it, I'd be fooled. <laughs> <laughs>